Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Nicholas playing Ring Fit Adventure! Wow, that was smooth. Just one take. That's awesome. Anyway, I actually just finished this day's recording. This is day 9, and I just finished uh, editing day 4. And day 4 is being uploaded. So, if you just finished watching day 4 and you jump to day 9, or if you go back the other way, right? You'd find out that I made a promise earlier today, and I fulfilled that promise, which is awesome, right? Oh, love this. This is why I created this series. This is exactly why I created this, this, this series. Oh my god, I'm just so excited. Yes! I am not really forcing myself, right? Um, what's the right word here? I'm not sure, but I made a promise like 20 minutes ago to, well, more like 40 minutes ago to myself and to you guys and to whoever might be watching this video saying publicly that I will do this right after I finish editing that video and I fulfilled my promise. Yes, I think this is one of the tricks you can play on yourself. Tricks with air quotes, right? It's actually legit. Um, it is about making a public announcement or even it doesn't have to be public public. I'm doing air quotes again. It just has to be something you said to someone else. Then your brain is thinking, oh my god, I told someone else about it. I'm gonna do this. If I'm not doing this, right, I'd seem like some kind of um, like coward or I don't know what's the right word. I just finished excising and my blood is not in my brain. But you know, it, it just felt wrong to not fulfill that sort of spoken promise, even though it is not legally binding, but still right? You still want to fulfill that. Hmm. Yeah, that is so awesome. Hmm. So good. Just now in day four's episode, right? I was talking about how if I do the exercise with Ring Fit Adventure in the morning, one is that I will feel elevated pain level like it wouldn't be that much discomfort for me in my lower back and because i just finished my exercise i can tell you exactly how i feel it is exactly what i said before the exercise right i was feeling oh my lower back really uh, it's uh, starting to hurt a little bit if it is um out of a zero out of ten scale right i would say it's discomfort it's not painful yet painful would be around say seven or eight and it was sort of three or four it's still in that zone where it's still discomfort it's not painful yet it's not the pain scale it's the from discomfort to pain scale if you understand right but after exercising now it feels like a one or two i barely notice um any kind of discomfort i think it's still there if you if i try to move around and look for that discomfortness if that's a word it's still there but now, because of the exercise, I feel much better and also I feel my core is more engaged and I just feel much happier, you know. Having this lower back discomfort really brings me down a slight notch. Yeah, you might be able to tell from the voice or maybe it was just all the adrenaline or whatever hormone my body is um, sort of producing after the exercise. Oh yeah, I remember. It does produce something to make you happy. Endorphin. Endorphin, I think. Yeah. Anyway, I hope you find this interesting and I hope you find this motivating. So if you need someone or need something to motivate you to follow through either your own routine or your own exercising regime, right? This might be it. Hopefully, um, I was helpful in a way or another, right? Cool, cool, cool. I hope I will see you again soon. I know for sure that I am going to come back to this series because of today. Because I made a promise and I fulfilled that promise to myself. 
and also to you guys. Oh, that feels just so, so, so good. Wow. And also, look at me run. I run so fast. And then I actually did more exercise than before. I think before I averaged around 17 minutes of exercise. But today, I think I did 24 minutes in total. Yeah, that's just awesome. Mm, so good. Yeah. Hell yeah! Mm. Okay, now I'm just super pumped. <laughs> and um, I hope you enjoyed this uh, video. Hopefully it was somewhat inspiring or motivational. And I hope to see you again another day. And I hope you, if this actually motivated you, right? I hope you tell me or if you leave me a comment saying that, Hey, Nicholas, thank you for this video. Thank you for this series. It has been really... Um, helping me to keep myself to my own promises. I hope I can achieve that with someone um, in this world, right? We all we all wish that we can do some good to this world. Um, with that said, I think I have said goodbye enough times. That's one of my... Um, I wouldn't say that's a downside. That's just one of my characteristics. I am reluctant to... Uh, actually farewell you know all right that's it I'm gonna leave and I'm gonna make some gaming content today and I'll see you next time ciao have a good one bye <laughs>
を下げて。
Oh my god, I don't know who that was, but that guy was just so energetic and I couldn't stand it. It was just too energetic for me. For a calm person like me, I like to do deep breaths. Deep breath in and deep breath out. Right? That guy was just too exciting. I don't know what's up with that guy. Maybe he just fulfilled a promise to someone or some people or something. But I don't know. Right? But I have the same wish as the last person. That is, I wish you to have a wonderful day. And I hope to see you next time. What happened to my Englishy? I don't know, but that's it. Have a good one. Bye. Uddeoshikiyose,
ゆっくり体を戻します手を後ろに回し左の手首をつかみます手首を右に引きながら首を右に倒していきましょう首を戻して手を入れ替え反対側も伸ばしましょう首から肩にかけて伸びていることを意識しましょう。ゆっくり体を戻します。体の前で手を組みます。手のひらを前に出しながら背中を伸ばしていきましょう。ゆっくり体を戻します足を広げて両手を上げ左の手首をつかみます手首を引きながら体を右に倒し体側を伸ばしていきましょう体を戻して手を入れ替え反対側に倒します息を止めないように注意しましょう。ゆっくり体を戻します。ストレッチ終了です。お疲れ様でした。